We're just in Tokyo Station now and heading to buy our tickets this morning. We're heading to Osaka. Jack had the very smart idea of asking the lady in our hotel to write down where we're going, how many tickets we need in Japanese. In Japanese. In Japanese. <laughs> because we're in Japan. The ticket office is over here. Alright, so first of all, we need tickets. Welcome. Please select a ticket type. Issuing tickets now. Please take your ticket. Thank you very much. That was surprisingly easy actually. Um, using the kiosk to get your tickets. There was a big queue as you saw, but you can avoid the queue. What? Pocky. Oh, Pocky. Oh, can I get some of that for the train? Yeah. Yeah, I want to get some Pocky for the train. Or they're just plain chocolate. Uh, just chocolate. Just chocolate? Yeah. Chocolate Pocky? Let's get. I think you should get a salmon. Can I get a salmon? A ginger with miso. Yep. Ginger with miso brown rice, yes. Arigato. Perfect. Okay. Good snack. Yeah, I think that's perfect. So I'm pretty sure this is our train. This is the bullet train now to Osaka. And we need to get on board, but I want to get a shot of the front of the train for you. Just that kind of really iconic, it's really like aerodynamically shaped nose at the front. Should be getting on the train probably, but Oh, this is so cool. This will be worth it. Look at this. Okay, really need to get on the train now. So it turns out that train before wasn't our train, it was just here. Anyway, it wasn't our train. This is our train. They're just cleaning it now. There are ladies that jump on board, clean the train really quickly, flip the seats around and get it ready for us. But this is our train now. We're going to hop on board and start making our way to Osaka. It's cool. We'll be stopping at Shinagawa. Are you smiling at the camera? Yeah. It's not a mirror to do your makeup. Can I have my shot? <laughs> reading up beforehand about the etiquette of riding on board the bullet trains here in Japan and there are signs on the back of the chairs that say things like turn off your mobile phones when you're talking you need to talk in a lowered voice and basically just not be loud and disturb other passengers I love that I think it's brilliant there's nothing worse you know what it's like being on a train or a plane and someone's being loud on their phone or talking to the person next to them or vlogging with a camera for YouTube stuff like that can be really annoying sometimes so sitting on the train here when it's really quiet inside it's great so we're about an hour and a half out of Tokyo now, on our way down to Osaka. It's about a two and a half hour trip in total. The speeds we're hitting here at the moment, I think, I think the maximum we get to is around 200 miles an hour here on the bullet train, which is insane. And the thing is, I thought it'd be like, oh yeah, it will feel kind of fast, but no, it feels fast. But you actually do feel the speed, and the impressive thing is the acceleration as well. It's not just fast when you're traveling, but the, the acceleration out of the stations, you can really feel it. But about an hour to go, we're gonna have a snack now, just have some food that we bought back in Tokyo. Just enjoy the scenery. It's basically to the, this side out the window here is the ocean. That side of the mountains and the countryside. 
that way, it's where we're going as a cycle.